with your storm team weather. Here's Chief Meteorologist Aaron Ayers, sponsored by Jim Bass Cars and Trucks. Well, we had a really nice Friday here across the Concho Valley, a really nice Friday evening for some football here. As we go into our weekend, here's what we can expect. A warm weekend for us. Temperatures getting up into the 90s for us once again on Saturday and into Sunday. Then a cool down on Monday as we turn into a new week here with more sun on the way for us towards the end of next week. And cool mornings into next week as well as a cold front swings through the area into Monday morning. Temperatures right now in Mathisville, we're at 72 degrees. It feels like 72, humidity at 59%, winds on the south southeast at 6 miles per hour across the area right now. And those winds are going to be around 5 to 10 miles per hour overnight tonight. Current temperatures across the Concho Valley, many of us in the 70s, low 70s, Sterling City at 70, Robert Lee at 74, Grape Creek at 73 here in St. Angelo. We're at 72, 75 out in Wall, 72 in Eden, 71 in Menard. So we're seeing those 70s, even some 60s showing up on this map at this hour. Today we got up to 91 degrees at Mathis Field. Our average high is right around 85 degrees for this time of the year. Our record, 107 back in 2005. This morning's low of 55 degrees is below average for us for this time of the year. We average around 60 degrees for our low. Our record low of 37 back in 1989 here in the Concho Valley. So a very cold day way back when. If you are making plans for your weekend, it's going to be a nice and sunny one for us, albeit a little bit warm. Temperatures in the 90s, mid 90s, or even above that as we go into to Sunday. So if you are planning on spending time outside doing some exercises or some activities outdoors, remember to stay hydrated as we go through the weekend. It's going to be a rather warm one for us. Looking at clouds and radar right now, nothing showing up across the entire southeast U.S. Not seeing anything on the radar and that's the way it's going to be for us here through the next several days in our extended outlook as we go into Saturday into Sunday. Sunny conditions, temperatures in the 90s for us. Then swings forward our cold front through the Lone Star State. That's going to bring some rain to portions of East Texas, not necessarily us here, but sunny conditions and cooler conditions as we go into Monday, into Tuesday, temperatures in the 70s and 80s for highs as we go into Wednesday, remaining in the upper 80s into Thursday for us. And as we go into the end of next week, temperatures still in the upper 70s and 80s across the area here as we go into next week. Here's a look at temperature wise where that front's going to be for us coming into Sunday evening at 8.30, getting close to the Amarillo area. And then as it swings through here early Monday morning, we'll see temperatures in the 60s for highs in Amarillo and Lubbock, 70s here in the Concho Valley as that continues to push on through. It'll keep us cool in the days ahead. Morning low temperatures. We're going to get down below where we normally are when it comes to Tuesday morning. Temperatures getting down into the 40s for us and then getting back into the 50s for morning lows here in the Concho Valley. Tonight we get down to 59 degrees under clear conditions. And for our Saturday, another warm day ahead of us. 93 degrees and sunny conditions on our Saturday. As we take a look at the next five days here in the Concho Valley, more sunshine, more heat for the weekend. Then that cold front swings through here on Monday morning. That drops temperatures into the 70s and 80s as we go through the rest of the seven day forecast with plenty of sunny conditions still to come next week. And we've got much more KSAN news coming up right after this break.